How's it going? Braden Spransky here. Talk about uh, my slap cover, my first cover of my life. I think this was in 2005 or something. Yeah, October 2005. That was a day with Lance Dawes. And I think we, I already went there and I broke my board and I hit him up and was like, hey, do you want to go back? And that day we got there and I think it was third try or something like that. And even in the footage, you can see that I don't really, you know, when you land something so fast that you don't actually recognize that you landed it. Cause I remember just, I see the footage and I can see it in my face and I'm like, because I didn't think that I actually did it. I didn't even know what happened. I was just kind of riding away going, okay, so let's get back up there and try it again. Yeah. And ended up, we seen the photo and seen the footage and we were like, oh shit, we did it. Yeah, I'm like it's just done. like right? that. And there's that bar right next to it. So we kind of all just went straight in there. And I don't know if anybody else has ever been to this spot, but because of that bar and because of it being on the pier, there's so many people who torture you. There's so many drunk idiots who have to scream and something to say and coming like, I don't know. But yeah, that was just one of those days that I'll never forget as long as I live. I remember literally just seeing even the clothes that everything was just kind of on some next level. But And whose magazine was that? This was Sean Peterson's, which I've shot a thousand things with Sean Peterson. He was one of my favorite photographers growing up. I still love him to death. We talk all the time. Awesome. And that's rad that you have his collection and you actually have his issue. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. Thank you, Lance. Love you guys. And do you recall how you first knew it was the cover? Do you remember seeing it for the first time? I mean, I, nobody told me anything. Yeah, I like, just remember Lance telling me like, when he actually, cause you know, this is back in film. Way yeah. before digital, I mean, I know digital was around, but everybody shot film. And Lance came at me a couple of weeks later and was like, yo, thank you. I love the way that photo came out. And that's all I remember. And I just, I don't even remember where I was or when it was, but I just, it was kind of a complete shock to me. Cause yeah. Slap Magazine, one of the best magazines ever. And just to be on the cover was such an honor. Still is an honor. Hell yeah. When you think of classic covers, Braden, what comes to mind? Uh, Jeremy Ray, Pauline from, what was the Water Tower, Water Tower. Yeah. I mean, anything when I was a kid with Trans World was always a big thing. Thrasher was, I mean, it's a skate bible. Everything always stood out to me. When I was a kid, I really liked Brian Anderson's cover of, uh, Skater of the Year, where he's just sitting in the chair. I always thought that was the coolest cover. I remember, I don't even know what grade it was, was I had Andrew Reynolds in my binder, the front blunt in Miami okay. on the Thrasher cover. That his, was his skater my of the front, year. yeah, that was my front binder for many, oh, I think awesome. two full years of middle school or something like that. Yeah. I mean, anything by Danny Way, especially, oh, what was the Trans World cover where he did the mega ramp and it's uh, just kind of a cell wet. You know what I'm talking about? Well, um, skateboard Mag, Issue yeah, 1. Skateboard Mag, yeah, issue that's what one. it was. Yeah, yeah, Issue 1, yeah. And then the weird one that I was obsessed with, which was, I thought was a great cover, because I still don't understand how it happened, was Steve Barra doing the backside flip over uh, the, plane the plane for skateboard Mag. That was Skateboarder. Oh, skateboarder, I'm sorry. Yeah. 